Hello everyone, I am Pato and today I am going to show you how to install both a weapon and vehicle mod in Unturned. It is actually really easy, so let's get started. So first of all, you need to have Unturned installed on your Steam client as you can see here. After that, you will need to head over to Community and click on Workshop. Then you will need to click on this search bar here and search for Unturned. Click on that and search. When you have done that, you will come to this page here. Here you can find thousands of free mods to install. But I would really recommend to scroll down a little bit until you find this most popular here under Browse Ready to Use. Click on Most Popular. That will send you to this page here. Here you can find the most popular ready to use mods over the time period of one week. Here you can also find mods ranging from weapons to maps. You can take anything you want, but I am going to take this mod down here. It is called the Atlas Corporation BAL27. So just click on the mod that you want. That will take you to the mods page. Here you can find pictures of the mod like here, but in some mods you can see small clips that showcase the vehicle or a weapon or whatever it is. So when you have decided that you want to mod, you're going to scroll down until you find this big green subscribe button. So just click on subscribe. A little bit further down you can find the description. Here there will be the IDs of the weapon. If it is a gun, like here, there will be two important IDs. The rifle itself, but also the magazine. So write these down for later. Now you can go back from here by clicking on the arrow in the top left corner. I am now going to download a vehicle mod as well, and I actually think that this mod here looks really great, so let's click on that. Again, scroll down to the green subscribe button and click on subscribe. So as you can see here, this mod actually requires another mod to function properly. But that is totally okay and just click continue. And on this mod, it's actually a little bit different. The IDs are on the pictures. But I actually think that this is really good since we can just look on the pictures and see what car we want. Then we can just remember the ID. And since I really like this car here, we're going to save this ID for later. Alright, so now we will start Unturned and check out the mods. So now that you have started Unturned, let's click on Play and then Single Player. So I'm going to try out the mods on PEI, but you can try out the mods on any map since mods work on every single map. So for the mods to actually function and be able to spawn in, you need to allow cheat codes. So let's go. Alright, so now that you're in the game, you're going to press a J on your keyboard. Or if you have changed the button that you talk with, press that button. So this is going to bring up your talk menu, and it's here you're going to write the commands to spawn in your modded items. So let's start with the weapon. Write at give, and then the ID of the mod that you saved before. And mine is 5010, and this is going to spawn in the Atlas Rifle. And as you can see, this one is not from the original game, and it looks really cool. It actually shoots really well, and uh, I would recommend to install it. Alright, so now my ammo is out because I killed the zombies, and here it's the same thing. You open up your chat menu, and you write at give, and then the ID of the magazine that you saved before, and mine is 5008. And if we open my inventory, here we can see that the magazine is in my inventory, and we can now reload and have 48 bullets instead of 30. So now I'm going to spawn in a vehicle from the mod that I downloaded before. But here it is a little bit different because you need to open up your chat menu and instead of writing at give, you're going to write at vehicle. And after that, the ID of the vehicle that you saved before. In mine is 16017 and that will spawn the police car. As you can see, this is not a normal vehicle that is in the game. And it also looks amazing and drives well and uh, I would recommend to install a lot of these mods to actually make the game just better. So if you want to uninstall your mod because you didn't like it or you just want to get rid of it, you need to locate back to the Unturned Workshop as I showed before. Then you need to hover over Browse and click on Subscribed Items. That will take you to this page where you can find your downloaded mods. So just click on Unsubscribe and Unsubscribed and now 
they're gone. But anyways, that is all for this video. I hope it helped and I'll see you next time.